Hello YouTube, um, I'm here making my first uh, deck review for Deck of the Week, and um, this week I'm going to be doing a review on a self-made jump left deck. So let's get this started. I run four hop hips, um, that evolve into three skip loom and four jump left. So I run a, a four three four line, and that's because I played three rare candy and a few other stage two, so that's what my jump up line is. Um, it's mass attack does for one energy ten times the number of Pokemon in play. So it's kind of useful if you're going against something with a nice 20 minus HP. So my secondary attacker, or actually kind of first, is Yanmega. I play three Yanmas and three Yanmega Primes. Well, one of the other two are proxies for your Mega Prime because I only have one. I had to trade for it a lot. <laughs> it's nice because for no energies you can do either 70 damage to the active or 40 to a bench. And it's kind of nice to have. Especially for no energies. Um, it's nice to get your Mega Prime out pretty fast. Usually before, uh, usually bef like second turn as fast as you can. And then later use Jump Luff as a... Uh, as a finisher. Anyways, to team up with Jump Off, I use P2 with Playground. Its ability, its attack, well, its ability, it's a baby Pokemon, so it can't be attacked when it's sleeping. And its attack requires no energies, and each player searches their deck for as many basic Pokemon as they like and puts them onto their bench. So it works great with Jump Off because if both players' benches are filled, then uh, Jump Off's attack, mass attack, does does 120, 120 damage. So that's nice. It can take down your omegas and stuff like that. Anyways, I run a 2-2, two, 2-2-2 two, uh, two, 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 Vile Bloom line. 2 um, Oddish, 2 Gloom, 2 Vile Bloom. And Vile Bloom is nice because the trainer locks you into your opponent. So no more Switch, Rare Candy, Reversals, that annoy you in the heck. Yeah, none of that. After you play Vile Bloom, everything goes pretty smooth because this deck doesn't play very many trainers. I just move a few things. Um, it's nice to have Bioplume, especially when you're going against an, a, a donking opponent, because uh, they play like so many trainers. Anyways, uh, I play two Heracross with Green Draw. I'm not sure if you really want to play those, but it's it's nice for draw power mid game, not late game, not early game, mid game. It's um, for two energies, it can uh, for two for two energies for one grass, one colorless. It can uh, draw as many grass Pokemon. Well, it can draw as many cards as grass Pokemon you have in play. So it's nice mid game draw power uh, when when you slow things down with Vile Bloom. Um, I play two Sunkern, which evolve into some Flora. Uh, so Flora's ability, Sunshine Grace, is once during your turn, search your deck for a grass Pokemon. So that's kind of nice. Um, it's um, it's nice to have one or two on your bench, and then just get your grass Pokemon. I also play Caterpie Metapod, one one, a one one build, uh, mainly for the. For Metapod's ability, well, of course for Metapod's ability, which uh, makes it so that all grass Pokemon have no weakness, so Yamega's not weak to Zekrom, like Zekrom decks, and uh, Jumbo's not weak to fire decks of any type, so kind of handy. Uh, but instead, you might want to run a Vespa Queen, because Vespa Queen's ability is that your bench can't get sniped. I run. Four copycats for Young Mega Prime. So when you have the same number of cards in your hand, you um, you can attack for free. So these are your free attack bonuses. Um, I run two Judge. It's, so it's either run four Judge, two copycat, or four copycat, two Judge. I kind of like copycat a little bit more because I don't know. Sometimes it can get you more cards, but hey, judge is there if you need to screw your phone at all. Um, I run 
to Professor Elm's training method for grabbing your either some flora, your Omega Primes, or jumbles, really, anything. Um, it's it's just nice and handy to have. I run I run uh three rare candies, which I can't find the other one. Oh, there it is. Three rare candies for uh vile plume, um, and jump love, so it's nice. Um I also play ten um ten energies. Well actually no, I play twelve energies um for jump luff and for other Pokemon that might need it, such as Heracross or um yeah, pretty much for Heracross and Jump Wolf. It's a nice thing to help with. And then I play um I play three switch, but uh, I only have one in my hand right now. I don't know what the other one's win. But I play switch just in case someone uses a reversal before you have before you have a uh, vile plume in play, and you can just kind of use a switch to reverse that effect. And it's kind of nice to have. Um, so that's been my jump love, vile plume, some flora, and y'all make a deck analysis. Hope you liked it. Um, it was a, it's a very nice and fun deck to play. So tune in for more videos and yes, Colin, signing out. Thanks for watching.